I just want you guys to see the armor that I have now. Look at that. That's the armor that I have now. Lucky looks kind of like that. It's a revolver. So, I just wanted you guys to see that in all its glory and the badass musics and the odyssey in the background and the the Indian money, but the not Chuck Norris money because Chuck Norris is on one of those somewhere. Anyway, I'm going to ignore those. All these, really. I don't really care. But I am going to do this El Dorado one. So, it's actually a lot easier once you have NCR armor. Like I... Oops. Not there. Um, like I do now. Just because they don't really, like, stop you, I think. Since you're dressed as an NCR member. You're just like, oh, hey, you're one of us. Alright, sweet, come on in. Since what we're doing technically, uh... Isn't... Uh, I don't believe they... Or I don't believe it's good for them, is what I'm trying to say. What am I doing? Alright, so now we can use that gun as well, which is alright from... But I remember what... How do I get over here? I mean... Oh, I can just climb up, alright. Hooray, intrusive, invisible wall remover. I love you. I love you. That's a great mod. If you have a PC version of this game, I... I would recommend getting that mod. So you can just... I doubt you could you could climb this this hill without it. So yeah, but my com the companions still don't really like that mod. It's not really companion friendly because they're just like, well, he's going through, but I don't think I can go through. I'm just gonna go whole way around now, you know. But yeah, so I have decided to do Dead Money, the DLC for this game. Uh, I've actually just downloaded it a few hours ago. And I'll, I'll do that as soon as I finish the, the main story of this game, I guess. That's what will happen. This is probably where we have to go right here. We got some friendlies over there. Yeah, some NCR people. Alright, that's good. That's as good. And of course we are dressed as one of them with our awesome rifle on our backs. And this is El Dorado substation. So I guess we're going... Stay out of the control room and enclosure, or there's gonna be trouble. But Got I'm it? one of you! Come on! Come on. Can I just go through? No. Is there like a back entrance I can go through? No, I'll just try and sneak in, I suppose. I'm hidden, I'm hidden, I'm hidden. Go through. Alright, is there anyone even in here? There are people in here. I don't know if. They hate me? Do they hate me? You better get out of here if you know what's good for eh. you. Come on, you guys love me. There you go. Alright, I'm leaving. Don't worry. I'm leaving. I am leaving. Alright, so report back to Yes Man now. That was incredibly easy. So Moon's actually still over here. I just got comment in one of my videos. Alright, so we did get NCR Infamy, but it it really doesn't matter. I don't think our rank actually went down. So. Hmm. Well, let's see. So now I just talk to Yes Man, right? Yeah, report back to That's Yes Man! Yes Ma'am, alright. So I don't feel like going back to my underground base anymore because it was being a bitch last time, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna leave people in here. For example, I'm going to leave Rex here. Who's, oh, sorry. The, some army guy. Um, is there anything really that I I want from him? I guess the these would be pretty good. I'll take those and just give them to Boone. Fine by me. I haven't used Boone in a while. I'm gonna switch him out for Rex. So you can have. Uh, yeah, you can just have all those, I guess. Right, so what do you actually have? I wasn't fine by me. Wasn't really looking at Benny suit, a few missiles, that super sludge. All right, but I do want him to. Eh, what am I saying? All right, well, oh, everyone stops following us anyway once we get up here. So let's go talk to yes man. All right, yes man, yes ma'am. I wish I had a sexy robot slave right there. <laughs> Oh, what has come to the world? Anyway, what gun do I have out? Oh, right, my rifle. And there's Yes Man's glowing, smiling face. I love you, buddy. I really do. President Kimball survived his visit to Hoover Dam. 
I like how I just completely nice changed my decision now, like twice Don't you love about that. Lucky 38 all lit up? Sign of things to come. Exciting news! The Legion's passing troops in a staging area east of the dam. Attack imminent! Uh oh. Monster of the East ready to roll! Monster of the East? Well, some of Mr. House's projections predict a moderate probability of civil instability subsequent to the NCR being driven from the Vegas region. One of the mitigating contingencies he planned was to enlist the followers to provide increased medical aid. I can do that. The they like me. Just seems like it might help keep things stable when we go independent. Not that I know what I'm talking about. Yes, you do. Wonderful. I'll keep tabs on the situation at the dam. See you in a bit. I'm sure they will support us. I mean, I'm already part of the followers, so they should. They should support us. And the elevator was, like, through here? Right. Yes, it is. Alright. Casino! Casino, yes! Because it's yes, man! Alright, that was really stupid. Um, you can stay here, are you? Yeah, you stay there. But Cass and Boone... Let's hit the road. Go ahead and follow me. Cash should never be dying now. They're okay. ridiculous armor on. She should not. <clears throat> so, yeah. Well, let's go talk to Julie Farkas! Oh, I haven't said that in a while. <laughs> well, it's good to get out, you know? Sometimes you just gotta you just gotta get it out of you, you know. Farkas! Right? You know you understand, audience. You understand, audience, correct? Hello, audience! <gasps> we are back outside. All right. Well, let's go through here. La di da. I don't even know what I'm saying now. Your safety. But the fort is right there. That's good. There's meat, which I don't really want because it's all radiated and crap. Like I should be good for the rest of the game now, and this guy is probably gonna give us something. Yes. Hey, you're the one who's been. Yeah, and he gave us a grilled mantis. That sounds disgusting, but I will eat it sometime eventually. And uh, Julie, Julie Farkas, Farkas, she's up here. I've heard a few patients mention the Securitrons are acting strangely, and no one has heard from Mr. House in a while. I murdered him. <laughs> Maybe okay. we'll be able to get our hands <laughs> on some me. of his Excuse me. That was technology. my psychopathic side. It would help our scientists greatly. Um, I, I, yeah, this one. Why should we support Vegas? They've locked Freeside out of the city and do nothing to help their neighboring townsfolk. Wow, whatever you have planned must be pretty big to give them the boot, but this sounds dangerous. I refuse to put my people at risk. If the NCR are pushed out, the raiders and other scum will run amok. Um... It is indeed our duty to teach and improve the living conditions of our fellow man, but we're talking an insane amount of logistics to make this work. I think I see now what you intend to set in motion. There we go. If this plan will bring us one step closer to revitalizing the region, you can count on our support. That was easy. So long as you keep us supplied, we will stay in the Mojave to provide care and education for those in need. All right. Well, sure. Would you like a stim pack? You'll need to wait. All right. Uh, can I sell you? Anything? You have two. You have twenty-seven thousand or twenty-seven hundred caps. Holy shit! Why did I not know this? Why didn't you tell me? Okay. Well, we have a lot of stuff to sell. Mostly ammo, if I remember right. Like, um, all that. I don't care about that. As well as that. Um, there's a lot of stuff that you guys have that my companion. I wasn't talking to the audience. I was talking to like you. Let's deal. Such as that. I don't want. Not so much that either. But I will keep it. I'll take that because I don't want it. Where's Boone? Boone, stop standing there! Come on, man! What are you doing to me? What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. Not gonna make my voice crack like that anytime soon again. But I'll sell as much as that. 
as I can. Or she, here she is, uh, right, standing by the pole. She's like a stripper doctor. So the great Caesar is dead. Happy news, but I don't know that it'll make things safer. The rest of his goons may be even worse once they take power. Sure, why not? So, let's see, what can we... What can we sell? sell oh my god, that's 20... It's 2,300 caps right there. Okay. Well. What else? You can take that. I don't care about that. Um. Well, I can get another 400 caps out of you. So we'll sell, I guess, like a lot of those. 27, 20. Ah, oh, perfect. Wow, that was complete luck. You run Barter Town? Huh. Apparently I run Barter Town. I'll take those, though. As well as all those, and that, and all those. I guess. And those, why not? And then sell some other stuff. Like, uh, those weapons that I didn't care about like that. Well, already, she's she's out of caps. Alright. So I now have 8,000 caps. That's, that's pretty ridiculous. Oh, I'm still over encumbered. Alright. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. All right. Um, you can take that, I guess. As well as that. I don't even need those right there. The flamer. I was planning on selling that, but that didn't work out too well. What else do you got? We can probably give you some of that ammo that we took back. Like those. I don't care about those. All right. She drop? No, she doesn't drop anything. Hey. All right. Cool. Okay. Hey, everybody. Sorry about this. Really, really. Oh, shit, I forgot to start my timer again. Wow, I'm, I'm bad at doing this. All right. Sorry about the random start here, but I was gonna go ahead and like, uh, this is kind of complicated here. I was gonna go ahead and start doing the the end mission, but here I am at the followers of the apocalypse place, and uh, I I went to talk to Arcade again and again because of course he randomly left, and now he's talking to me about this quest that he has to do. So. Any day now, Caesar's going to try to march across Hoover Dam and kick NCR out of the Mojave. We're getting caught up in something important out here. Hell, after how you handled Benny, you're practically right in the middle of all this. I know I'm just along for the ride, but it's made me think about the past and how I might be able to help out. Let me just explain something here. I've actually already beaten the game. Uh, what happened here was I went and beat the game. I didn't. I didn't go talk to Ganon because. I was like, ah, eh, screw it, forget it. He's he's fine where he is. Uh, but so I beat the game, and there's actually a separate option that I want to do right now. So I went back and started from a previous save file. So I'm gonna use this as the final, the final few parts, and uh, I'll actually put a a little clip in for my my first run of the, of the final boss fight, just because I, well, you'll see, you'll see, it's cool. I wasn't always with the followers, or with the NCR. My late father was an officer in a group called the Enclave, a remnant of America's pre-war government. Memories being short around here, not a whole lot of people remember them. But they did bad things. Terrorized communities, kidnapped people. Eventually someone stopped them. I was born a few years later at a military base on the coast, a place called Navarro. A lot of different places. I only know what I was told. Some of them were cut down by the NCR and the Brotherhood. Some of them went east. My mother never told me what happened to my father, but she and I went south with some others and integrated into the NCR. When the NCR learned that Enclave personnel had integrated, we kept moving to the fringes. It's one of the reasons why I wound up out here. The Enclave did a lot of bad things, but there were good people at Navarro. Good people with a lot of experience. Not many of them are alive anymore, but I think they can make a difference in the fight against Caesar. That's a hard question to answer. I know I don't want the Legion to take Hoover Dam. So militarily, yes, I want them to help NCR. If possible, I'd like to figure out a way to help the NCR win Hoover Dam without holding New Vegas. Great. I'd like you to talk to the old timers, the remnants. I don't think I could convince them by myself. To them, I'm still a kid. But you're a big part of what's happening out here. When you talk to them, they'll understand how important this all is. I've kept in contact with them over the years, so I know where you can find them. But I doubt they'll open up to you unless I come along. 
I know I'm not always the most serious guy around, but this means a lot to me. Thanks. All right, so Ganon is back in our party, and we're gonna go talk to a few of the uh, what do you call them, the Enclave people. So it's called the quest is called for on Auld Lang Syne. I don't probably didn't pronounce that right. Right, I can't pronounce anything right. But uh, for Auld Lang Syne, it's uh, I believe it's a Scottish poem that means "Let the good times roll," or in a more serious terms, "For old times' sake." Uh, same same concept though. So we're gonna go to this one for why is only Cass? I thought I had Rex following me, but I guess he's back to the Lucky Thirty Eight. But I chose to go here first because we have Lily here because she, of course, randomly left, and uh, I'm gonna go talk to her right now. You should have heard Leo sweetie. He laughed and laughed when that old man in the box exploded. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a great time. Oh my god. That was a that was a great Thanksgiving. All right. Leo thinks there will be lots more chopping to do now that Caesar is dead. I do hope you'll be careful, pumpkin. All right. So I want to talk to her about something. I I don't. Grandma soul. Huh. Oh, here we go. All right. Such a. Let's see. I need to ask her about Leo. Oh, someone. Yes, who is Leo? Leo is a very bad man, Pumpkin. Yes, you are, Leo. Don't try to deny oh, it. She's crazy. He tells me to do things. Terrible things. And sometimes the medicine isn't enough to keep him quiet. You shouldn't say things <laughs> like that where Leo can hear you, dearie. He doesn't like it. All right. All right. Well, that's. I think that's all we need to to do there. Um. So we're, she's gonna. That's part of her like little. Oh wait, no. Is she okay. Yeah, she is following me. That's part of her little like side side thingy she's got going on there. Her little. I guess you could call it like a loyalty mission for Mass Effect. I don't know. That's what I would relate it to. The loyalty missions for Mass Effect too. But, uh, so the first guy we want to talk to is this old doctor here. Is there something else I can do for you? You have a weird mouth. I'm intrigued. So I'll that was easy. Reunion. I'll be handing things over to Calamity, so talk to her if anything comes up. Oh, you'll need my word from the past phrase to get into the bunker. Friends. Don't forget it. No, oh, you're a friend. Okay. That was easy. All right, let's go find the other four. So, um, actually... Doc Henry always was a hard one to figure out. It didn't seem to matter whether he was working with humans or dogs. He had an equal lack of affection for both. A regular Diogenes. I'm not sure what the man was after. Knowledge is power, but to what end for Henry, I have no idea. The problem was what mattered to him, not its practical impact. He simply solved riddles because they existed. Not everyone dreams of being a... Maybe it's enough just to do good for the short time. But he's probably saved more lives than I ever will. Cool story, bro. Anyway. I uh, actually... Uh, funny story. I actually already started playing the DLC. So the first part... The first two parts of the DLC... Will... Or actually have been recorded before this. Which is... It's really convenient. Don't even try and figure it out. It's... It'll hurt your head. <laughs> like, I, I kind of screwed up with some... Oh, I'm hungry. Kind of screwed up with some timing here. So it, it's fine. I can just. I'm going back and doing it anyway. But you know, it's just a little bit confusing. So is this? No, that's not the person. Probably. Let's see which. Oh, that's probably what's his face, Manny Vargas, right there. I don't know. Want to go to motel room over here? Probably up there. Uh, or is that it right there? Let's, might be it right here, actually. Door to Boone's room. Don't know why that's red. Seeing as how Boone's in our party. So you can start shooting at us? I mean, come on. The second Enclave remnant should be in... No, that's Lily. Oh, sleeping on the job, eh? Hey, Daisy? Fiend junkies over at Vault. Fine weather for flying. Oh, this. Ch it's times. Yeah, I remember you. 
told you everything about us, did he? Well, it's been a while since I've had my hands on the controls of a vertebrate. There's a chance I could crash us in the middle of Lake Mead. That place seems to attract aircraft for some reason. But if I get one more chance to fly, count me in. I'll be there. My part of the past phrase is dear. Dear friends. All right. All right, there you go. That's two out of five. Let's go find the other three. Oops, not what I meant. All right, so who would be the next easel, most easily accessed one? Not that one, probably. So we could go with uh, this one. Yeah, let's go with this one. Grab grub and gulp. Is that what that said? I don't know. But uh, I don't think any of these people should really be hard to recruit if this is as simple as it's... Since my mother died... Dude, what? Daisy's been the only woman in my life. She your wife? She was the only other woman close to my father. Pedophilia. She flew him out on over a dozen missions, including his last. I've always been close to Daisy. There have been some good men along the way, but lovers make poor confidants. Daisy never had children of her own, so she was always there to listen. Being in the Enclave didn't mean much to her. She just loved